Is there anything like that you've seen so far like that you are like specifically referring to? Like anything you've seen behind, you know, that maybe you didn't know someone said about you and now you're- Oh watching. yeah, I mean, like obviously that conversation that Maya and Sierra had um, was something that I was not privy to. And I found out with everyone else in the world um, that that was said about me. So that was a great feeling. And I don't think that anyone finding out that people are talking about them is a great feeling, but then having that be on like TV too, um, it's just like, ugh, you know, so no. Yeah, I mean, I, I can't imagine, especially like, I mean, did that like change your relationship with either of them? Or do you feel like you're at a strong enough spot now where it's like, oh, that was a year ago, it doesn't matter. Um, it definitely made me pause and think about it. Like, I feel like out of everyone in the house, Sierra and I are probably not the closest. Um, and she's the person that I think that we've had, like, the most distance from each other um, with my whole experience in this. Um, so, and we, like, don't really speak that frequently. Um, but I don't think it will necessarily change my relationship with either of them at this point right now, just because there hasn't been like there hasn't been that kind of proximity where I feel like I could even say like hey this upset me like that that level of friendship isn't there yet and I think that like also like helps viewers like I mean just in general like people you know the more they get to know you and see your family whatever like they get to like understand who you are more as a person you're not as quote you know like surface level (laughs) no not at all and like I feel like a lot of me explaining stuff that might come off surface level is like if you have to like listen to the context of what I'm saying right like me like how I explain growing up is like if I'm saying like, oh, I went to an all girl school, it's not like, oh, like I am privileged in the fact that I went to all girl school. It's like, no, I'm trying to explain to you like how I've like navigated female relationships my entire life and like how it is like very foreign to me to have like male relationships because like I've never really, in my formative years, I wasn't exposed to that. So it's like yeah. a weird thing. I only had four years in college and like, I wasn't really trying to prioritize yeah, a relationship then. I was trying to have a good time.